Hi, my name is Avi Galoni, and I'm the chair of the Information and Decision Science Department at the Sci Sim School of Business. In IDS, we offer a concentration in business intelligence and marketing analytics. This really is business analytics. And business analytics is a combination of data analytics applied to business. What is that all about? Well, within this area, we learn things such as statistical learning. That's how we build statistical models to perform predictive analytics. That's how we learn to make great decisions based upon the data that we've collected. See, the purpose of business analytics at the SciSim School of Business is to learn data analytics skills and applications in areas such as in accounting, finance, marketing, and strategy, strategy and entrepreneurship. Yet, the focus is just to remember we want to have competitive advantage from our knowledge and skill set in analytics. Now, there are various courses that the Information and Decision Science Department offers. All students at the SciSim School of Business need to take courses in statistics for business and quantitative methods. In these courses, students learn inferential statistics as well as regression analysis, and they also learn the basics of calculus. However, if you would go on to being a BIMA major, you would be taking more advanced courses in analytics, which we'll describe in the next slide. Some of these are quite intense, while others might be a real lot of fun. For example, the required major courses in our area, and there are four of them, are as follows. In business and analytics and programming, students learn the software R. R is one of the major data analytics and data science software packages that are available, a very important skill to have. Next, in business intelligence and consumer insights, once they've mastered R, they learn how to create statistical models and perform statistical learning and predictive analytics. Well, it's very important that our students know how to query data, know how to get data from different sources. And in data management for business analytics, students learn how to run SQL queries and learn how to aggregate and collect data from different sources. Finally, in business intelligence capstone project, there's a real case study where students put all these skills together in one course. Now there are two elective courses, at least two elective courses, I should say, and students choose from data visualization where students learn about Tableau, a real fun data visualization software, as well as packages within R and Python, which are geared for data visualization. Remember, a picture is worth a thousand words. In data-driven decision-making and honors course, students learn how to make informed and correct decisions from data, and unfortunately how easy it is for some great people to mistakenly make the wrong decisions from data. That's a lot of fun and very important. In decision models, we use Excel to build models. We use Excel as not just a spreadsheet, but as a modeling tool. And finally, in sports analytics, well, do I need to explain what that is? That's just a lot of fun. Besides taking these courses, students who want to major in BIMA need to have a minor or at least three business electives from one area. These three business electives could be in accounting, finance, marketing, or strategy entrepreneurship that would give them a minor, or they could take at least three courses in computer science in order to apply for jobs which are going to require some heavier data science skills. Here is our full-time faculty. I am the associate dean, one of the associate deans, I should say, at the SciSim School of Business, uh, a full professor in uh, statistics and data science at the SciSim School of Business and the department chair. Dr. Shu Han, she's an associate professor who focuses more on the information systems aspects of our course courses. 
Dr. Kochaga is an associate professor who focuses on the operations management and data science aspects of our courses. Dr. Kofton, like I, like me, is in, in statistics and data science. And Professor Rosenthal teaches the computer science aspects of the data analytics material. What will you get when you graduate from the SciSim School of Business from the Information and Decision Science Department? You have expertise in many different areas and you're prepared for exciting careers within business analytic roles, within media and marketing firms, banks, hedge funds, consulting firms, and sports teams. Here are some testimonials. As you can see, Hannah Gold, who is a marketing science analyst at Condé Nast, has succeeded due to her knowledge of technical skills in R and SQL, as well as in critical thinking that she gained while at the SciSim School of Business. Sarah Cousins is a business intelligence engineer, and similar to Hannah, is successful due to the combination of the technical skills she learned as a BIMA major, as well as her critical thinking and business skills that she has learned while at the SciSim School of Business. Dr. Sriram Subramaniam, the head of data sciences at Condé Nast, has been very impressed with the quality of the business analytics students who've applied for positions at Condé Nast. And the two students who were aforementioned had very strong data analytics skills and have made significant contributions to their teams very early on in their careers. You could do so as well, but you have to take the first course in BIMA. Here is our team at the Information and Decision Science Department. We really are more of a family than a team. And we look forward to seeing you on campus in the very new, near future at the SciSim School of Business studying Information and Decision Science. Please feel free to reach out to me by my email or by my number on the left. See you on campus soon.